right now, first at four, Orange County deputies hunt for the robbery suspects who prompted a SWAT standoff. Good afternoon. I'm Jim Payne. I'm Martha Sigowski. Investigators say that two men are armed and dangerous. They, along with a third man, shot a man during a robbery at a business on Elman Street near North Orange Blossom Trail and Silver Star Road. The search for those suspects led deputies to surround a home on Piedmont Court. West 2's Michelle Meredith is there live. And Michelle, they have one person in custody. One person in custody. He's one of the nine people who voluntarily walked out of this house behind me. They walked out before the SWAT team went in. The SWAT team rolling in a neighborhood off Ivy Lane and partial lockdown, all to find suspects deputies thought were hiding in a house on Piedmont Court. And when the SWAT team moved in this afternoon, they searched through the home. And there was no one inside. So the investigation is open and ongoing. The investigation started close to 7 this morning with a violent robbery at another location on Elman Street. According to deputies, three young men with guns robbed the owner of a scrap metal shop, then shot him. Yeah, I carry a, a small concealed pocket revolver. This businessman owns a shop nearby, says the neighborhood is so dangerous he packs heat. They apparently robbed the man, and then after they got the money, I, I heard they shot him in the back. After the shooting, deputies were looking for a dark El Camino, which they found parked behind the house at 4780 Piedmont Court. Law enforcement did a call out. Nine people voluntarily came out of the house five men, three women, and one child. Andrew Leister told us his daughter and her family live there. Are you frightened to hear that? You're possibly your grandson is involved? Yeah, I'm frightened to hear that's why I'm here, yeah. So we'll see if real, what really happened, you know, what really going on. And so is law enforcement. Meanwhile, the neighbors want peace. Every morning I'm mostly awakened by some kind of violence in this neighborhood, and I'm just praying for it to be stopped. So they have one person in custody, two suspects at large, and the business owner who was shot, he is listed in critical condition. Live in Orange County, Michelle Meredith, West 2 News.